Thought of the Day on Premier. A friend of mine had his school years blighted by an awful condition called acute laziness. His A-level grades were not great. So he prayed. Oh Lord, please find me the right university. And sure enough, just one college accepted him. He worked hard and got a first class degree this time. So he asked God again to find him the right university for an MA. But this time he had dozens of offers. Where do I go next? He asked God angrily. The answer he got rocked his world. Where do you want to go? Seems fair enough. God had given him a brain, a device with a hundred thousand million living cells and 15,000 trillion active connections between them. Look, it's a lot. Take my word for it and move on. Still, some people can't believe that God would ever ask them, what do you think? But Jesus used to say that quite a bit. He famously asked the disciples, what do you think about paying tax? Quite what answer he was expecting, I have no idea. Jesus didn't just drop the final answers into people's laps. He really wanted them to do a bit of thinking first and arrive at the answers with him. Maybe that's why he doesn't always drop the answers to your burning questions straight into your lap. Perhaps he wants to work things out with you. And your brain. Perhaps. What do you think? I'm Ben Cohen from Mission Direct, the two-week mission trip organisation. Thought of the day on Premiere.